What is up, everybody? It is my distinct pleasure to get back in the studio again today to check out how the FM8 synthesizer from the Native Instruments Library is working on the brand new Apple M1 Mac Mini. We're still fairly early on in April of 2021, and, you know, it's technically not supported, but, um, you know, everything I've tried so far has been so far so good. However, we're in full experimental mode, so we're just going to load this up and see how it goes. Deep space. And this is part of the transient attack library for FM8. And um, they've got an FM7 library. It looks like there was a previous version and an FM8 factory library. It just sounds as beautiful as I remember it, you know, and um, again, it's one of the tools in the toolbox. Um, I don't frequently use it, but I sometimes use it for stuff, and it's good to know that all is working better than ever.
I'm starting to get it in ways I didn't get it before that each of these quadrants of the uh, of the uh, morpher um, allow you to choose different FM matrices. Because as you can see, the FM matrix switches up every time I change into a different quadrant. Pretty rad. Gotta say. Pretty rad. Um, and then in the effects library, we've got a small library of stuff in here. And I'm not sure what that does. So maybe someone in the comments can help me with what the effects library does in FM8. <clears throat> I can look it up too if I ever want to know. But I'm just saying. It's a nice little snare sound. That sounds pretty cool. I've got to say, sounds pretty bad-ish. Yep, pretty rad. Um, what else do we have in here? Junky XL. You might know him from the recent Godzilla vs. Kong soundtrack. <clears throat> where he absolutely knocked it out of a park in terms of a action movie soundtrack goes. I mean, what can I say, guys? As you can see, everything I try, I think there's a theme here. You know, I'm hearing an echo across all of these videos. I keep, I tend to say the same thing over and over. But um, no, it's it's actually really cool. And I'm, I'm pleasantly surprised, um, but not so surprised at all <laughs> with, uh, you know, this kind of last set of tools. Um, these are some of the... Um, the I started with the topmost tools, right? The top, you know, uh, three to five tools I used the most. Uh, those were the previous videos, and now I'm on into, um, you know, the tools I don't use as much. I still use, but I don't use them as much. And so um, my heart wouldn't be broken if I opened one of these and it didn't work all of a sudden. But it is great to know that uh, everything's working, you know? It's fantastic. And, uh, yeah. As you can hear, sounds better than ever. Until next time.